Assalamualaikum. I welcome you all to the this new uh, lecture series in which we are going to discuss about uh, electronic workbench. And in this tutorial, we are going to start uh, the basics about the electronic workbench. Uh, electronic workbench is a simple software uh, which is used to simulate different circuits. Um, and it is mostly used in electrical engineering. Uh, in most of the subjects, you can use this software. Uh, so first of all, this is uh, the integrated development environment of electronic workbench. Um, here, here we are having a, a file button. By this, we can open our uh, simulation or we can create our new simulation. We can save it uh, and so on. Mm, from the next block, we can uh, copy some of the component as we have used in the simulation which can be used uh, somewhere else. In the next block, uh, we can uh, rotate, flip any of the component we have used, and we can also zoom in or zoom out uh, our uh, this uh, uh, simulation, this schematic. Uh, the next uh, tab is of analysis. In this uh, analysis tab, we can analyze our simulation in the runtime, we can uh, check uh, the voltages. We can also uh, use this and uh, display graphs uh, and so on. Uh, and uh, we can ar arrange our simulation. And the last tab is uh, about the help of this software. Uh, now moving on uh, to, to, uh, to some of the other options here given in this uh, software. Uh, this is the portion where we are going to place our components and uh, from where we can pick our components are uh, this is the list of components given in these different tabs. Uh, so first, uh, and the very first button is of sources that we can uh, use different sources here. First of all, we are having a ground uh, next to the ground. We are having a battery source uh, moving on towards uh, the DC current source, AC voltage source, AC current source, and so on. And we are having different voltage sources uh, we can use in our simulation. Uh, we are having a, a plus v, VCC uh, or uh, VDT here. The next uh, block is a basic block. Uh, we are having some basic components here. Uh, first of all, uh, we are having a, a connector connector used to connect the uh, uh, different uh, wires together. Uh, we are having a resistor, a capacitor, inductor, transformer, a relay, uh, a switch, a time delay switch, and uh, some other options. Uh, the next block is of diode. Uh, we can use simple diode, uh, a Shockley diode, a LED. We can use a bridge and so on. The next block is of transistor. We can use different transistors here. Uh, the next is analog IC. Uh, we can use uh, different analog ICs, uh, op amps, and uh, so on. We are having some mix ICs in which we are having analog to digital converter. Uh, the next is digital ICs, uh, which uh, are used in basic uh, 74LS. Uh, continuing with that, uh, these are mostly used in uh, digital logic design. And uh, the uh, block which we are using, which we are going to use mostly is uh, logic gates. Uh, here we are having uh, different logic gates and or not and so on, which uh, we are going to use. Uh, the next block is of digital block. We are having multiplexer, demultiplexer, encoders, flip-flops. Uh, we are going to use uh, in our simulation. Indicator block, uh, we are having a voltmeter, ammeter, a bulb, a red probe, a seven segment display, and decoded seven segment display, a buzzer, and so on. The next uh, block is used in uh, control systems. Uh, we can use transfer function, we can simulate our uh, different uh, control system uh, simulation uh, in this. Uh, we are having uh, different uh, tabs here we can use. It. And in this uh, miscellaneous block, uh, we can write some text. We are having uh, different other uh, uh, 
components which we can use in our simulation. And the last one is uh, very important uh, instruments. Uh, in our instruments, uh, we can use, uh, first of all, having multimeter, uh, a function generator, oscilloscope, border plotter. Again, it is used in control system. Uh, word generator, logic analyzer, and logic converter. So these are the basic uh, blocks which we are going to use in our uh, in, in electronic workbench. And this is the button from where we are going to run our simulation. We can activate our uh, simulation by simply pressing this. Uh, but before doing that, uh, we have to make some uh, circuit here. Uh, I am uh, using electronic workbench for uh, digital logic design or uh, digital uh, system design. So I'm going to use some basic gates here. Uh, I am taking uh, a simple AND gate. Uh, I'm going to press it and place it in our uh, this window. And we are uh, having an AND gate here. Now with the AND gate, uh, uh, from uh, the indicators, I'm using a, a red probe here as an output. Uh, we can uh, rotate it. Now I'm going to connect it with the output of this AND gate, simply placing our cursor here. Or just place, uh, just click on the lower end of the logic tree, and we will get a wire here. Now, for the input, uh, we are using uh, basic uh, from the basic block, we are using switches as input. We can place uh, two switches here, and we can simply rotate uh, we can uh, simply uh, switch them and by pressing uh, double click i am going to do uh, use key as a as uh, the input for uh, this switch and for the next switch i am going to use key of b so whenever i press uh, a it will be uh, the switch will be connected with this terminal Normally, it is connected to the other terminal. When I will press B, and this switch will be activated. Now, uh, what were uh, what we are going to connect with this switch is a voltage source. I am going to use a VCC. Uh, you can see here with this terminal of the switch. And sorry for that. And for the same VCC, I am going to I I can use uh, with this input. Uh, of the switch. The next uh, input uh, I'm going to use as a, a ground. So I'm going to place, uh, simply drag and drop this ground here. And we are connecting these grounds. One input of the AND gate is with the B key. The other input of the AND gate is with the A key. And we have completed our simulation. Uh, we can double click the VCC and you can see here this is the we can also label them now I'm going to uh, run our simulation I have run my simulation you can see the real time here uh, in seconds now both the inputs are uh, low are connected with the ground uh, these two inputs are getting low signal the output LED is turned off, uh, the output is low. If uh, we connect uh, our uh, of, uh, B signal with the high terminal, it will get a high input uh, uh, for this AND gate, but it is a AND gate whenever we are having both of the inputs for this AND gate high, we will get a, a active high output as you can see B is high a is high we are having uh, all the red probe is uh, showing indicating that the output is one if we uh, use b as again zero it is uh, you can see the led is turned off and again we can uh, change the uh, inputs by pressing keys from the keyboard 
hopefully this is informative for you if you are having any questions regarding electronic workbench do comment in the comment section uh, thank you for watching allah